What's up, PMP? I am back, and I have a battle against iTunes Link. This is an RU battle. I had RU last time also, but I'm just enjoying RU so much that why not? So who's going to lead out with Funky Kong? I'm going to lead out with Demonster. I'm going to set up the rocks, but he realized that I was going to set up the rocks, which is why he went out to Polyrath so he can start setting up. Um, I went for the curse thinking I might be able to break a couple of these subs and then just switch out to Dragon, and then... When I switch out to Dragon, I can just phase him out with Dragon Tail, but then I forgot, oh, he's going to be in a sub. And I didn't realize that until I went for a Dragon Tail with Dragon. But anyway, so what you got here is him setting up, and yeah, I'm trying to break these subs. I, I actually went for EQ again, because um, I thought I'd be able to break the sub, but I didn't realize that the last one was a crit, which is why I was able to break it that time. So now he's going to get another free bulk up, but I am going to break the sub this time. And then be able to go out to Drodagon. So that's what I'm going to do. And, uh, yeah, luckily for me, he's actually going to go for the Waterfall as I switch, though. Um, and the reason that's lucky is because I have Rough Skin Rocky Helmet combo on this Drodagon. And that is going to do a lot. Uh, yes, yes, yes. So I'm actually going to sub this turn as he subs. Um, and I don't really know why I went for the sub. Uh... Well, I, I don't know. It doesn't really matter. But he's going to go for the Focus Punch. Uh, it's n He's not going to take the recoil this time because he's not actually making contact because I'm behind a sub. I didn't realize that at the time, but now it's kind of nice to know that. Um, but regardless, I'm going to switch up to Casper here because I don't want to take the Focus Punch. And then I'm going to switch back into Drodagon so he has to take more Rough Skin Rocky Helmet. Um... Pretty much just a wasted turn there, really, when you think about it. But, anyway, uh, I guess it worked out pretty nice for me. Well, really, I guess the reason for that is because since I'm since it's resisted, uh, I can actually take a waterfall. So, I think if he went for the focus punch, it probably would have killed. But, anyway, I'm going to go for the sucker punch that time. He actually went for the bulk up. It doesn't really matter at this point because I know the rough skin Rocky helmet will kill him. So, I'm just going to let him... Hit me with the Focus Punch, take me out, Rough Skin Rocky Helmet's going to take him out, and that's GG for the Polyrath. Although I did have to sack um, Drodagon, I, I feel like it was worth it since that thing was setting up. I'm going to go into Oscar the Grouch here, and he's going to trick, and little does he know that I had Black Sludge. So he's going to want to trick that back, which means I'm going to be able to get up both layers of Toxic Spice. Which is very useful this match. Very, very useful. Um, and he's actually going to switch this next turn. Which means I'm going to be able to get up a layer of spikes also. Which is really nice. So now I have two layers of toxic spikes. Spikes and rocks. So I'm looking pretty good. Uh, he's going to go into Funky Kong again. I know he's going to go for the EQ. But why not just sack this thing. Because it's already done its job. The Really, all I have on this thing is spikes, T-spikes... Um, explosion, and I don't even remember what my other move is. Maybe Sludge Bomb or something, I don't remember. But anyway, uh, he's going to switch, obviously, and I knew he would switch, so I went for the bulk up. Uh, and I actually carry Ice Punch instead of Psycho Cut, uh, because in RU, I feel like it's just better coverage. And luckily for me, he has a Gligar, which um, means he's going to have to switch again this turn. I'm going to go for the Leaf Blade, thinking he might bring in Slow King, but he's actually going to go to his Magmortar. Um... Which, you know, it, I, I predicted, but I predicted the wrong thing. And, really, what's bad about this is now he's going to be able to outspeed and have a chance to go for that Will-O-Wisp. But, the Will-O-Wisp misses. So, he really would have been able to stop me in my tracks there had that, uh, well, not really, I don't know. I'm thinking after plus one, even if I am burned, I'm thinking it would have done a lot of damage. I think after Toxic, Magmortar may have died that turn. Uh, so really what would have changed is he would have been able to keep his Rotom. Um, but I would have been able to Revenge Kill with Haunter anyway. So, in uh, the same story with Magmortar had it not killed on Magmortar. So, really, uh, since my Haunter is Scarfed, it doesn't really matter. Anyway, I know he's Scarfed, so I'm going to have to switch. Uh, he's going to go for the EQ. And now, since he has Truant, I'm just going to go for a Rock Slide. And after Truant and his second Earthquake, the Toxic is going to be enough to take him out. So that's really good for me. You know, I don't really see Regirock very much anymore. Um, 
which kind of sucks because I really love this Pokemon so much. I, run, I actually run Max Spec D because his defense is so high. I mean, he can take it. So he actually takes a lot of hits. He sets up rocks. He can curse, although curse has never really been useful for me. Rock Slide and Earthquake are obviously very useful moves, though. Um, but anyway, that was the double down. I'm just going to fire off a Leaf Blade here. Knowing he's probably going to go for the Scald and try and burn me. And luckily for him, he is going to get the burn. Um, but at this point, he can't really do anything. Uh, he's actually going to go out to his Gligar here. Um, hoping that after this burn, uh, the burn would be enough to KO my Gallade. And then he would be able to get off a Slack Off next turn, maybe. But that's not going to be the case. I'm actually going to live with 4 HP. Good job, Gallade. And, yeah, that's going to be the game. So I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Mosh Pit. Peace.